team. What would that look like? Who would she meet? Well, think about it this way. Remember what we saw her in the, the one world of like cutscene we want? Imagine if we got like eight of those, and she'd she'd totally be with like Almar and Captain Falcon. Like Possibly. she would have been part of that group. How she got to that island in the first place, nobody knows. But hey. right now we're fighting on a different set of islands. On small battlefield, Hayes versus John Numbers, Diddy Kong, and We Fit Trainer. Yep, this is the New York City classic starter. Right, as of late, these two players, these two characters love it here. No top platform to mess up the movement, to mess up the ledge traps and Back. the corner pressure that these players are known for. But the space to make it happen all the more often. They're looking to scramble and scrap, but numbers controlling this banana in theory is huge. But Hayes trying to make him pay that soccer ball, though, gonna give you another chance. And Hayes. Trying to find ways in, but keeps just getting stuffed out by the wall of hitboxes numbers has put upon him. So I want to point out, we, we just saw that first stock get taken by a Hail Mary F-Smash beating that Hail Mary uh, monkey flip. Numbers has gone on record saying that he will sometimes neutral get up into F-Smash specifically to see if the opponent falls for it. And it's happened a, a shocking, alarming amount of times. Listen, that's what they call a chub check. Kind of, yeah. And numbers, you know, it, it's one of those things where you might as well do it and see if they get away with it. That forward air is another suction example. Same with that down air there. That down air that we just saw where you double jump or drop off dare yeah. and then we grab ledge is what Nick District likes to call the we fit mid-level down air, right? Uh -huh. It's the down air you match because if any player tries to overextend into you, they just get spiked and die. For the first and if they don't, frames. then... Then they get well, put at a very bad angle. Well, it's like, if they don't, then they can punish you, but most people don't. So it's not that good, but it works a lot better in practice than it should be in theory. And speaking of better in practice than theory, I mean, that banana toss, Hayes was thinking of something that didn't come together, but at least gets to redeem it by getting on the board. Do you know what I just realized for the first time? Like, after watching John Numbers after all these years between two different sets of games? You enlighten me, friend. So, Zeno, you know how... We were talking about this just a little while ago, you know, pay Devin to be a meteorologist because it always rains on days when Numbers is playing. It just it just occurred to me, Numbers holds the sun that parts the clouds. That's why it's always raining. He has the power to part these clouds and always does it to win. <laughs> Listen, the question is whether it's going to rain. And look at that. Whether it's going to rain or shine. Down which, here. Oh, not quite. Which we Fit Trainer is going to rain supreme? Is it trying to stretch those shoulders or those toes? Those well. Oh, it's, we're gonna find out. See, there it is. Again. I like the back air poke from numbers, trying to find the auto cancel window, but Hayes is so efficient at trapping landings. Things, and then you set. just turn around and. Oh, do yeah, this. I mean, people forget, right, that all of Wii Fit's moves have a hitbox behind her that it sends at a very, very cheeky angle compared to the hitbox in front of her. Oh, we we here in New York have to know. We have to know this at this point. Like, see, that, that's the down air. That's that mid-level yes, down air I yes. was talking about where you jump in, but lands on the banana. It doesn't matter. Hayes gets caught jumping because he was overextending himself, right? He was trying. He threw the banana. He was then trying to push numbers off stage. Numbers mm -hmm. said, I'm going to cross you up. Now you have to turn around and come back. You have no resources to punish me, so I can be as aggressive as I want. Hey, look, speaking of music choices, we were talking about this just a little while ago. Well, yeah, the it, rare KK Condor. It's a Xeno Saga. True. In that, top that, four, that, of that, course we're going to see KK Slider. Yeah, that, that's how you know this is on a Saturday. Yeah, no, it's, this, it's, it's, this like, it's like that saga. TikTok trend, right? Mm -hmm. We're Xeno Saga. Of course we have KK Slider at 8 a.m. 8 p.m. God bless. Now, this is Hayes' counter pick, often to go to town and city. And as I. Thank you for not falling into that, by the way. But as I always say, no one goes to town and city with good intentions. No, you are trying to cheese somebody somehow with those side blast zones. And Hayes, so efficient, right, at carrying you into those Edgar scenarios just like this. But is trying it to Trying to find any way to punish numbers at ledge, plus trying to use these side platforms, I think a huge part of why he's going here as well, Chuck to it. just mix up his own ability to get off the out of the corner. Wow, he tried to, he really, numbers really so, tried to banana combo extender. You know what's really funny about that? I smelled the up air coming, but because he re-grabbed the banana to hit that near one, it wasn't able to kill confirm. Yeah, so you don't find, 
find the up air, you don't find the counter hit from Hayes either, but what you do find is at least a reset scenario. Numbers now trying to rack on some damage here, try to close out the stock, limit the bleeding, Backers. but Hayes just knowing that any ounce of pressure he can find here in Numbers house is necessary, but it's integral even. Mm -hmm. Sonic. It is 100% necessary to try and force, you know, you have the lead, but Jesus. And like I was saying earlier, you know, how much of a lead do you really have on John Numbers if the word game is not on screen and your character is the only one left standing? Well, at that point, you're just watching. And I don't think either of these, these players play that character. I love that finding his way under the peanut with a little bit of hurt box shifting, finding uh -huh. the banana uh, on the punish, right? One of the few ways that Weevit can kind of get a risk-free punish attempt on that pop gun, and Numbers not only does so, but continues the positional advantage state, right? Not racking on damage, but holding stage control throughout this entire interaction. Mm -hmm. Like, he still hasn't reset it, right? He's just for being forced to play the game on his terms and finally resetting it. But even then, Numbers, right, gets to save by the platform. No problem, no time in the corner. Right, pass. You get a pass, go, collect your 200. Nobody's business. And he has not been... Obviously, like, it's Wee Fish. He's gonna go to Ledger eventually, but... Like, Numbers has been playing this mostly center for the most part. That's how he's racking up all this damage. And, you know, we meme about... John's playstyle, but the man knows how to scrap if he needs to. He knows how to scrap and scramble his whole way through. I love the poke attempt, that, but that was barrels. Yeah, that was objectively the Bro. correct answer. They've been surgical. They have been surgical throughout this bracket. Ooh. Almost caught the jump there, too. Watch Catch it. Salutes the banana, the pressure. I like that Numbers is willing to back away here and just toss it off the reset. For Hayes, that banana being in play, even if his opponent has it, is such a huge resource for him that when it comes, that when he it goes off the table, he has to back away and reset because that was cheap. Like, it takes one hit for you to just steal a stock away. And if you if you noticed, he actually like he was clapping down tilt to push him further into the banana peel. Yep. I like that shield pressure, right? Saying, okay, a hey, sure, you're gonna soccer ball, it stops you from getting banana, it keeps you in shield a little longer, it's not gonna do a lot more. Point blank. numbers. Hey, he's well. laughing about that. Well, She's like, yeah, he you charges got it. those salutes, so they're almost all the way full. This one is all the way full. Yes. But what he does is so he mixes up the timing on the charge release after the fact. Because when it's almost there, it's gonna take longer, right? You might try to air dodge it and then it still hasn't come out yet. At, he's not a high enough percent for down throw back air, so instead, number is gonna just rinse, repeat, and whittle away the stage control one step at a time. You know, at some point, I need to ask John to, like, when he's done playing a set, I need him to take a picture of, like, you know how when, like, the match is ended, there's, like, the stats green? Mm -hmm. I need to see numbers, like, take a picture of how much percent he's healed over the course of a five game set. Well, because I mean, it's it'll doing after dividends. Every game, but yeah, it absolutely does, right? Even though it's chip, even though it's about a percent or so each time, you do that five, ten times over the course of a match, right? That's still multiple hits that you are then just completely taking off the table. And when it's a last hit game, Sonic, like that one or two hits might be the difference between life I mean, and we, we saw it, like, we saw it a little while ago in, uh, whatchamacallit, Hayes almost lost to Justin just for being, he was 2% away from this being Justin John uh, winner's finals. Literally two-ish percent. But unfortunately, it's not what happened. That's why, you know, Diddy Kong's still on on the screen right now. That being said, Hayes has done what Hayes does so well in this game, too, right? And that is adapt. He has been getting the download on numbers. And while numbers, frankly, kind of ran away with game number one, here in game two, it's been a different story. And one that numbers is still not out of the woods on just yet. Hayes yep. is whittling him away to find a way back into this one. But numbers... Scoops you off kill? the ledge, just like that. Getting DI checked a little on the way out. And says, you might have adapted, but son, you've got a heck of a lot more to learn. You are in my house. This is my domain. Domain expansion activate. Pow! Look at, look at, look at this DI. He, he is DIing pretty much <laughs> straight up there. Straight up and out. Domain expansion. We fit studio. We... Is that is that is that a uh, dot WFT? It's guys. It's W dot FT. Mm -hmm. www dot FT. There you go. I was talking about domain expansion yesterday, and I was like, I don't know where it's from. I just know the memes. But yeah, I was a, right that it is. Uh, it's a Jujutsu Kaisen yeah. thing. 
And boy, when it hits in this game for these players, it sure do be hitting. Game three, going right back to Town and City. And Hayes I trying to commit more robbery behind the Gracie Grace on this stage. And we didn't talk about it a lot last game, obviously, when the numbers favor, but I do really like this counter pick for, from Hayes, right? We yeah, talked about good. the short side blasters, but we saw last game as well. But being able to banana toss out of disadvantage onto these platforms and have it basically be brought Ooh. right back to you to see stage control and platform control for free is absolutely immaculate <gasps> for Hayes. Oh, that... And numbers, Save wow, them. he, Save he them. came up short. He went into that intentionally. That was so incredibly intelligent by John Numbers. That was almost a reversal too, because, uh, hey. Speaking of reversal, I don't, I don't need to play the game that, anymore. <laughs> that was a reversal of fortunes, if there ever was one, right? Hayes had the stock locked down against Numbers, and N Numbers played the heads up play, called out his angel drop, and found another chance. Hayes, well, Hayes said, okay, well, you got me. I guess it's time for me to run it back. I, I, After, need, I need to play this death like death. this is my actual winner's tournament stock. Hold on, wait, one hold second. on. Numbers might just find no, a grab no, here. No, 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 not quite. I mean, that was pretty close. That was pretty close to dis disaster striking for Hayes. He's going all the way out there, what but barely that? finding his way back. It, I think he's, like, trying to look for some, like, cheeky mistech on, you know, mistech wall on barrels. But it's very strange all around, right? He just hasn't been able to find his mark on some of these overextensions. Did that monkey flip could have been so much worse for you. It could have, but it wasn't, and you count your blessings because you've only got a limited number of interactions unless you can find a way to stem this bleeding. Numbers may not have found the pivot grab, but does find the pressure after the fact, and Hayes is swinging right now, Sonic, and he's desperate to get something started. I need the stock lead now. Yesterday. Um, hi, I'd like to order uh, one, one stock lead, please, with a side of potassium. Please and thank you. That... Okay, that almost looked like a flub confirmed, but he got it. Yeah, he, de he John definitely just kind of getting cheeky with the DI there, plus we fit her box shifting meant it was a little bit harder to line up than maybe E. Hayes wanted it to be, but he still cleans it up, so able to maintain his pressure going to this next stop and comes out of the gate swinging. This he is, is the stock lead that he needed. Frankly, Sonic, remember, he has seed in this game too. He has looked fantastic in this game three. Yeah, maybe that was part of the plan. Yeah, that we talked about the download coming in, right? If the, when your back's against the wall, that's where you pull out all the adjustments, and Hayes is really showing them off. But numbers uh, reminding you that it's not sunny outside until he says so. So that came about because Hayes ran back to pick up the banana. I don't know if I agree with that in that instance because you had numbers like in a potential edge guard situation. Yep, but it's just it's just prioritizing your resource for what you saw as the highest risk reward. It's often really hard to remember that we it's just gonna punish you for that because even when he does throw absolute the sun she's not doing it at that range speaking of numbers try to steal it away right there down this here. is a disaster situation for Hayes Goodbye. he's gonna get his foot put down had it back his hat I'm stumbling over my own words here he the set the goes to John numbers I was gonna say he had the opportunity to come back into it he was making his way back after the overextension, but just fell into the same trap repeatedly there. And there was a very, very niche interaction. I'm going to point it out when we get to the last stock, if it was recorded. I'm pretty sure because it was like right before the reversal situation. Uh, you can see in the last replay box on your on your view. Listen, chat room. I did so Here, good right? About so what happened mm -hmm. there, the wind box of sun actually pushed John away so he wouldn't get hit by the barrels. Mm-hmm. And that's something he will have... Yep, literally right, yep, there, right there as well. Right oh, there. It did it the first time around, and now here. And he's already a little further away, but it does happen earlier on. On And then he drifts around at that point. Well, Yeah, unfortunately, Hayes tried to double dip to secure that stock. But uh, this is John Numbers we're talking yeah. about here. Uh, and chat, we we did so good about I did so good about not as as Devin likes to say tripping over myself, interrupting myself, if you were. But it's impressive. sometimes, <laughs> sometimes the moments get hype enough. There's nothing we can do about it. I mean, yeah, that's absolutely true. And that that was a good set, all things considered. We'll be seeing Hayes once again in losers finals, fighting the winner of Gaius in five noches con Alfredo, also known as Burst.